Here's a bit of fun. Surprise pictures. What? No surprise there, I hear you say? Well, just open it up. <laughs> and there's a surprise. One half of the picture changes. And do you know what? They're very easy to do. Just take a piece of paper, any size you like, or thin card, and just divide them roughly into thirds along the top, like that. And then on one of those thirds, just draw a line down like that, and then fold it along the line, like that. And then it's just a case of drawing a very simple picture across your paper and up onto that flap. Now, don't do anything complicated, just a really simple picture. I'm just going to do a little picture here of a man in his little rowing boat, uh, like that. And it's a good idea if you're going to do a picture of a person to do one half of it on one side of that flap and the other half on the other side of the flap, and I'll show you why in a minute. And just do something that's very easy and very cartoon-like, nothing complicated. Yeah, a real simple sun, look at that. <laughs> and seagulls, and a cloud up here, I think. There he is, he's just out fishing. And there it is, a nice simple picture. And when you've done that, just open it up, and now you only have half a picture. And the idea is to complete the picture on the other piece of card. Now, it's a good idea to do the bits that you don't want to change first. So there was a cloud up there, wasn't there? I think I'll do another cloud in there just to fill that space, because now it's a slightly bigger picture. And I'll just finish his boat off there, like that. Now, the reason I said to you, if you're going to do a person, do one half of it on one side of the flap and the other on the other half, is that you can now change his expression. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make him look, look really shocked. Look at that. Boom. And his mouth open. And just finish his arm off there. And put his little tongue out there like that. And unfortunately... He's almost dropping his fishing rod. And why is he dropping his fishing rod? Well, wouldn't you, if you were confronted by a whopping great shark, and you're out for a quiet day's fishing? And that's the surprise inside this card. Let's draw it in again again, just doing it very simply, very cartoon-like. And then you can colour it however you like. You can paint it, or you can felt tip pen it. And when you've done that, it looks like that. And there it is, a picture that you can open up, and there's a surprise inside. <laughs> it's a good effect, isn't it? Here's some more I've done. Look at these. Here's a guy skiing downhill. Again, a very simple cartoon, but you open it up, and watch out. Avalanche! <laughs> very simple. And another one here. There's a guy in the countryside. He's just sniffing the flowers as he's going along there. But watch out, mate. Don't bend over too much, because behind you, there's a bull. And, you know, if you do them on card, just thin card, then you can actually send them as birthday cards. Look at that. Snappy birthday. Try it yourself. A surprise picture. <laughs>